Christmas time is here. Something, something cheer. Look at that little Christmas tree. Oh my God. You're a little Christmas tree, Glenn. I'm so little. Yeah, you are. <laughs> uh, anyway, welcome to another edition of Throwback Thursdays. My God, I'm and beautiful. And <laughs> the second Thursday video with a Christmas theme. Yes. So, it's, it's a great uh, tradition we're holding here at KFR. A whole two-week-long <laughs> tradition. Wow, these lights are so warm, it's great. I don't even have to get in the car later for heat. I'm fine <laughs> because I'm not a little bitch. Uh, this KFR hurts my self-esteem. <laughs> <laughs> so the movie we decided to do this time for Throwback Thursday was a shop or The Shop Around the Corner. Yes, yes. starring... Uh, Jimmy, Stewart Jimmy Stewart and a bunch of old actors whose names I don't remember. There, there are at all. a lot. Uh, Margaret Sullivan is the actress. The oh, main, look the at main you! Actress, look at you! Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, essentially, I really didn't notice this until one of my friends commented on uh, my picture on Facebook. Yes. It really is essentially like the original "You've Got Mail," but you know, with real mail, oh, God, it not is. email. It uh, is. I didn't, I didn't make that connection until he said something, and now but, uh, it's just totally. But that's all that's right. That's totally it. Yeah, yeah. That means there's an original, and "You've Got Mail" is not original. How yeah. about that? Uh, do you want to talk about it? Uh, yeah, I'll talk about it a little bit. Let me tell you, if you have noticed anything in the last couple months, you'll notice that I've been on a a streak here with Jimmy Stewart movies. Like, there's a lot. Mm -hmm. I, I'm pretty sure I've watched six just this year alone for the first time. And this is the newest edition. And uh, it, was a, it was a good Christmas movie. The best part about it is the Christmas theme didn't even occur until, like, the end. Yeah, it didn't start off as a Christmas movie. Um, Christmas was more or less just a... Uh, it was just a season. Yeah. You, you could say it was one of our unconventional Christmas movies from last week. Yes. Um... But we didn't see it. But we in didn't time even to make, know, yeah. really. Uh, but yeah, I, I really enjoyed it. It's it's, yeah. it's nothing spectacular. This movie's not going to change lives or anything. No. But it was just a nice, fun Christmas movie. And uh, the thing I thought is, that surprised me is that it had a lot of things that I thought were Theobolden, as the Germans say, also known <laughs> as Forbidden, uh, such as suicide and affairs yeah. in 40s movies because this movie was released in 1940 yeah. and has some heavy topics for that time. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Well, yeah, if you if you mostly know me, you'll know that I'm not like the biggest fan of classic movies, but this just felt like a movie in... Remember, if you ever watched our Netflix and chill movie, I said, this is a good movie to Netflix and chill to in the literal sense, not the <laughs> sense. <laughs> Not that sense. This is a good movie to just sit at home and just watch because it actually is good. Yeah. Jimmy yeah. Stewart is amazing as always. Uh, even uh, Margaret Sullivan was, was really good. Yeah. And the best part is about this for me was if you've worked retail or just anything at all dealing with customers. It had you, some pretty solid jokes. You're going to feel for this movie. Other than that, I really don't have much to say about it. It's not a spectacular movie, like I said. There's really not much to say about it. It's just a nice, fun movie. Yeah. Not going to change lives, but I, I certainly enjoyed it. Yep, everybody was good in it. It's just a good, just good movie to sit through. Just, yeah. just sit through it, man. So for the original You've Got Mail, Whoa. I'm going to give it a, a th I'm going to say three out of five. I mean, yeah. that's not, again, nothing spectacular. Yeah. I probably won't go out of my way to watch it again, but if it's on TV, I'll sure as hell watch yeah. it. Yeah, I'll, I'll give it a three and a half. I'll, I'll go one above you for some reason, but I'll do it. I'll break you don't our, have a reason. You just I'll want break to. our streak of like going along at the same rating. <laughs> so we'll do that. Three and a half. Okay. I enjoyed it. Oh my! <laughs> oh my God! So much Christmas! Ch oh my oh nose! My nose! But here's the deal. Over here is gonna be our review, which was for what, Mike? It was for nocturnal, nocturnal animals. animals. We saw that this week. We saw the crap out of it. I don't know if I slept through it. I fell asleep with the last Amy Adams movie. Hopefully not this one. But you know what? Hopefully I won't. Here's the deal. Over here is going to be our last Thursday's video, which I did. And it was hilarious, but I don't even remember what it was. <laughs> uh, unconventional Christmas movies. Unconventional Christmas movies. <laughs> so click on that. Below that's going to be Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Check out our social media, like our stuff, comment on it if you want. Yeah. And just join along the fun of KFR. Watch the movies. Michael. We're going to be watching a lot of Christmas movies this month, so get used to it. Listen to them. 
Mm -hmm. Mike wants to below that, though. Below that mm -hmm. is the like, dislike, subscribe button. Uh, you know, if you like it, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And subscribe. And there's yeah. people coming up and I feel super awkward. Well, here's the thing. We could just... Uh, no, wait a minute. Yeah, wait about, a minute. How you doing, buddy? Like, I'm doing all right. Great. How are you? You know. Oh, why this. am I always the center of attention <laughs> when people are just walking? Us? So, uh, yeah, below <laughs> all that is the comments section. Uh, if you've seen... Oh, if you've seen the wow. shop around the corner, tell us what you thought about it. If you enjoyed it, let us know. If you didn't enjoy it, let us know. If you haven't seen it let us know i don't know why you would that would be a very short conversation but just let us know let this us is know. the key let us comment. know if just type let us know, let us know. Don't i'm sorry don't i'm sorry that. i'm sorry i'm sorry